Hello everybody, it's Tanya from Dolly Day's Nursery and today is my Monday. Well, here is this little guy, and you know, he hasn't been getting a whole lot of attention these days. Um, I guess I just kind of, um, I'm pulled, <laughs> pulled toward my own work these days. And uh, this little guy is the Larry Sculpt by Natalie Blick. And he's the first reborn I ever bought, and he was a custom at that time as well. So uh, he was quite special to me for quite a while, but you know what? I'm losing my bond with him, and I figured I would dress him to see how that goes. But um, I've even had the conversation <laughs> with my husband about putting him up for adoption and uh, he also agreed I mean of course with the exception that if I sell this reborn I get to get a new custom made not by me but by another artist that I would like to have their work so that's where I am with him and um, he was not um, what you would call a cheap custom and um, his artists actually have done reborns for movies so she is quite a good artist and also uh, she is making a lot of silicones oh my gosh I would love every time she puts up another silicone that she has completed my heart melts <laughs> he's not a um, his matting is different it's not like he's smooth he's yeah I don't know um, what kind of matting it was that she used um, or what kind of varnish, I'm sorry, I should say, because there's different varnishes. I don't know if it's a satin varnish or what, but um, he wears zero to three month, three month size clothes. And I believe he's uh, six, six pounds and something. So... But he's, he's a sweet pea. So this is my Monday. <laughs> uh, I didn't know, I, I kept wondering what to uh, use as a theme. And of course, Mondays. Um, and I apologize for the lateness of this video, but uh, I was working all day and um, came home only long enough to get ready to leave again um, because the men at our church took their wives or significant others or friends out to supper for Valentine's. Oh, how sweet. And, um, and this is also our anniversary, wedding anniversary week. So, um, yeah. So my Monday. Hmm. 
It was a work day. And, um, oh, I tell you, I, I have this little thing that I meant to put on Instagram, but I never. And it's Monday, and the word, the letters for Monday is spelled down straight, and there's a line for each um, letter of the day, Monday. And it says, maybe this day is not one of your favorites, but never forget that every day you wake up is an amazing gift and it's up to you to make it count. <laughs> I thought that was very cute because who likes Mondays? Uh, you know, you go through the weekend and it's like, is it Monday already? How can it be? Our time just slipped away. Oh my. But you know what? It comes regardless if we want it or not. <laughs> time does not stop for no man or a woman. Now I think it's time for you to get a diaper change, bud. So, um, what did I just do with this diaper? Now that's a crazy one. There it is. It's gonna put a, a Winnie the Pooh diaper on. That's the back and this is the front. And I have a little Winnie the Pooh outfit that I'm gonna put on him. Yeah, so um, we're not long back. I got to throw that one out because it's so worn. As you can see, it's a doll. It's not a real baby. There are no parts showing. Uh, I haven't been brave enough to take him apart, but he's all, I'm thinking poly pellets. And that's like his whole body is full. And it makes him so easy to hold. Like the only bit of polyfill is right here around his neckline. I thought that was interesting. Now his legs has fine glass beads. But, uh, and he's on a jointed body. And of course he's in good condition. I haven't, I treat all my dolls the same. They just, um, they just rest around in the crib. I think this diaper will fit you better. So my Monday was a normal Monday. It was go to work come home. However, I did have that outing with that date, <laughs> date night with my hubby. Oh shoot, I forgot your onesie. He's got some sweet curly hair and brown eyes. Let's see here. So here to here. Put me in some blue. So I uh, just want to say again how much I appreciate the um, the response I'm getting for cards 
um, for Jasmine. And uh, if you don't know who Jasmine is, you can go back to some of my videos. Um, and she's in them. She's my niece. And she helps me with videos when she visits or when I visit her. We get together and make some videos. She lives three and a half to four hours away from me. So right now it's winter and we don't get to see each other very often during the winter because of the dangerous driving and we we work Monday to Friday and it's hard to get away. We can't go with the um, uh, possibility of getting stuck with a snowstorm. So we have to be back in order to go to work because we both do um, personal care in, in uh, people's homes, personal homes. So we definitely have to be at our work but I do really thank you for being so kind um, to respond to my request for birthday cards for Jasmine and it's the first time ever that she said she wanted to spend her birthday with me <laughs> and uh, it's very, very touching. But, um, so I have a weekend planned for her. She's coming to stay for the weekend for Friday and Saturday. And, um, so for the Friday, I'm going to make it fun mail Friday. Um, so that I can surprise her with the mail that is coming for her. I have five pieces of mail for her so far uh, that arrived, some last week and, and some today. And uh, she is going to be so excited. I just can't wait. And I'm, <laughs> I'm so excited myself. I'm like, I cannot tell, I cannot even tell her mother because I'm just afraid that she'll somehow through that bit of communication that she would uh, pick up on it. So I'm going to leave it alone. It's just me and my husband who knows about it. And of course, all you <laughs> lovely people, but uh, it will be, she will be here in one week. So, um, it's a little longer than a week. Um, so hopefully if you haven't sent the card yet, that you will send it very soon because it could take a week or more for it to arrive, um, to where I am. But, uh, it's so awesome. I just can't wait. I, I know that she's going to be so excited and, um. And there will definitely be a video. So we'll do that video and she will will do the shout outs to each person who she opens uh, the card or the parcel from. There's a few parcels here for her already. So uh, I, I really thank you if you're sending more than just a card because that's going to, uh, I don't know, I can't even find the words. I know it's going to totally blow her mind. She's going to be so excited. And uh, she watches videos all the time of the Reborn um, community. And um, I, th I think it's just going to make her feel so special to receive some mail. <laughs> and um, I've got confirmation even uh, from Stephanie Ortiz and from Kelly Maple that they are sending a card as well. And... Like, that's going to be fantastic. And Kelly Maple, she watches, Jasmine watches Kelly Maple all the time. And when we went to, we were going to Utah for, uh, for uh, the Rose Doll Show. 
and I told her that uh, Kelly Maple goes to this all the time and she was so excited and I told her that I would if I see her I would get her to stop and take a photo with us for her well who's one of the first people that we bumped into going down the hallway through the hotel Kelly Maple and I mean this was even before the show started and um so we stopped and had a few pictures taken and when I sent them to her her mother was like she's bouncing off the walls right now <laughs> so I can just imagine when she opens a card from Kelly Maple she is going to be so excited <laughs> uh, and I can just picture it <laughs> I can um but yeah, so anyway, um, thank you so much for um, being so sweet to send a card to Jasmine. And uh, I had a few more notes today from people saying that they have already sent a card and or they're going to send a card. And it's just wonderful. In my mind, I was thinking, you know what, if I could only get like four or five, maybe six pieces of mail for her to open it would be fantastic but if the people who already told me they're sending um, cards if I receive them all by before the 21st when she comes for her birthday party I'm expecting there's going to be about 18 pieces of mail for her to open and uh it's, it's just fantastic. So, reminder of that. I'll put my uh, mailing address in the description for those who don't have uh, the address. And um, But you would need to get them in the mail um, definitely in the next day or two in order for them to arrive to me. Uh, because everything takes so super long for me to receive mail. Um, another thing I want to remind everybody of is in a previous video, um, I introduced a giveaway for Valentine's. Um, it's not going to be drawn on Valentine's. It's going to be drawn on Wednesday. So it's going to be my win it Wednesday video. So you need to check that one out and make your guess on how many um, hugs are in the bottle. Um, and only on that video, not, not in this video. I don't want to see your guess in this video. It has to be on the original. And uh, yeah, so. Uh, and another giveaway will be coming up um, next month. So that one I shared on Sunday, so you can check that one out as well. That one is going to take a little extra time and effort to get your name put in for that draw. So if you're interested, you have to go back to Sunday's showcase video and check out the details on that. So um, my Monday is coming to an end uh soon be bedtime for me and i'll try to get this uh, video uploaded before i go to bed so it's actually still monday <laughs> but yeah it's been a busy day and uh, this little guy my mom always says he looks like he's crying because his eyes are so watery um yeah, so to her, he looked super realistic because he, his eyes are so watery. He always looks like he's just crying. He's either hungry or he's tired or something. He just wants something. <laughs> but uh, anyway, this is a cute little outfit. This is a, a little jacket that... Um, Um, came from 
My Little World. Is that the name of it? Katie at My Little World. I actually wanted to buy it. <laughs> uh, and that is over a year ago. And um, I had sent her a little parcel. And so she messaged me back and said that she was going to send it to me, gift it to me. And anyway, time went by and I didn't hear from her. And I'm not the one to remind people <laughs> uh, that, you know, they said they were going to do something. So I left it alone. And then I purchased a couple of pieces from her uh, Instagram sale. And she sends me a message and she says, as I'm going through my bin full of clothes, I came across this. I was supposed to send this to you. <laughs> she's almost like she's lashing out at me through Instagram message telling me um, I should have reminded her. <laughs> she felt so bad that she had forgot to send it to me. So she put it in with what I had ordered. So this is it. And I, at the time, needed it for... Uh, if you remember the Elliot I did for a lady and she wanted all Winnie the Pooh and I was having such a hard time trying to find Winnie the Pooh items. But anyway, um, it's a little too late to send that. <laughs> so anyway, that's great. It looks cute on this little guy. And I had purchased these little pants to go with this because <laughs> it has the light blue line through it. So when I came across it as I was organizing my closet in the nursery, I thought, hmm, the next time I change this little guy, he's going to wear it. Well, he's the only one that can wear it right now in my nursery because he's the biggest that I have. But anyway... I think that's a wrap for Monday, and uh, I will see you tomorrow. I think tomorrow is going to be Thrifty Tuesday, I think. Anyway, I will see you tomorrow, and I hope you have a great rest of your Monday. Um, by the time this is uploaded, it might still be your Monday, but it won't be mine. <laughs> Anyway, I will see you very soon. Take care, everybody. Bye.